A teenager with special needs targeted in this heartbreaking attack. And tonight he is speaking out. The Turlock teen says he's still haunted by what those bullies did to him. They've been identified and disciplined by the school, we're told, but so far no criminal charges. New tonight, CBS 13's Rachel Wolf with the victim story and the anonymous donor stepping up to help. We've all seen the viral video. It is heartbreaking. And that's why the community reached out to replenish the things that were stolen from him. Tonight, that young man is saying thank you. The video was jaw dropping. A student with special needs sucker punched in the face and jaw, begging for mercy as the boys grabbed his sneakers and his bike. They didn't really say anything, they just started doing that to me. 14 year old Michael Valdez says he doesn't want to watch it because the bullies stole more than his belongings. They stole his self confidence. It hurt me because I was confused because I really didn't know what I have done. Since his mother spoke publicly about the attack, the community has reached out, replacing his stolen bike, among other things. Well, I got a basketball and this net for my hoop, and I got some sh basketball shoes. It's restored. Restored a lot of faith in, in me, you know, which is good because I was just really sad and hurt. His mother has been overwhelmed with the cards and gifts, some monetary for Michael. It makes me feel better and about Turlock and all the good people that there are here. Family and friends are now planning a bike run this Saturday to bring awareness to the issue of bullying with the hashtag Bike for Mike. It'll start at Seasons Park and end behind Turlock Junior High, where the assault occurred. It's never going to go away. I'm just always going to stay in my mind. Michael says these painful images will never be erased, but can be replaced with love and kindness from others. But I'm very thankful for that, and I really liked it. And I appreciate it for all the stuff they've said and the just the joy they've brought to me. That bike ride will kick off at 10 o'clock Saturday morning.